hi guys welcome back to another video but before we get into the video make sure you do what you subscribe and hit the bell notification so guys i just want to start off with harmonize and Ravani because harmonize instagram he have a new girlfriend after the breakup with kajara so guys leo leo tumeona kuwa Ravani he was chilling with the same girl harmonize i kwame introduced talking about a mess so guys i was like what's going on Ravani are you always gonna eat some leftover the harmonize <laughs> it's clear kuwa Ravani he is very jealous of harmonize he is very insecure like wakati harmonize ali ingiria kajala muliona kuwa Ravani alienda kwa ma, kwa mtoto wa kajala it was messy and guys i feel like Ravani he is jealous of harmonize success after he was out of wasafi contract and he is out of it not like Ravani he's pretending oh i pay 1 billion you did not we all know that allegedly we all know kuwa you and diamond are creating all this stuff like you pay to get out of the contract you still in wasafi contract allegedly diamond is still it from you and you are jealous because harmonize he is getting all the money he is working for so guys jump in the comments tell me what do you think about Ravani chilling or you know trying to shoot her shots kwa huyu girlfriend mpya wa harmonize anyway guys let's move on and talk about this story mekwa ike trend ya huka db wa kenya guys <laughs> when i'm telling you kwa kenyans they always found a way to trend so kuna wewe msichana amekuwa ki make headlines juu ya kufanana na Cardi B I can say kuwa they uh, they exactly look like, look like because sometimes he took some shot like akipika picha unajua unaona kabisa kuwa anataka kufanana na Cardi B the makeup the hairstyle yani this girl he is she is obsessed with Cardi B so i'm take huko instagram akasema kuwa Cardi B amemwandikia message and guys it looks like it is real because as you can see the the dms it looks very pretty real guys jump in the comments tell me if you think they look like so guys let's talk about this new couple in the town Kuna huyu mu-youtubers akona show yake hapa YouTube siju anajita um, guys siju anajita guys let me let me read siju anajita press new town so guys press new town na Cindy aka Rory Harvey wa huku Kenya they are dating so guys this hoe like Cindy you are a hoe like you change boyfriends the way you change your hairstyle let's talk about it like the way you change your clothes if cindy akibadilisha nguo anabadilisha na mwanamume mwingine allegedly guys this is very cheap i feel like this is all not real they are only trying to get attention as you can see in the video like this video is fake look at the one meleta yani guys i am done with this fake relationships mona kuwa yule master pia alikuwa amesema this is all for entertainment there is no kick like these guys like the, we, 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 we all know guys i am I'm not going to expose anybody but we all know he does not love Ponani. Anyway, guys, let's move on. Okay, guys. So let's finish off with Tanasha Donna because Tanasha Donna she's making some big moves. So Tanasha Donna ame alikuwa amewekwa kwa newspaper talking about good stuff. We all know kwa this is not the first time Tanasha amewekwa kwa newspaper but guys as you can see alikuwa kwa hiyo newspaper na huyu director video director mkubwa huku Kenya anajiita Ivan. So Tanasha have always have you know alifanya kazi na Ivan mnakumbuka pale alikuwa amefanya ile nyimbo yake na calligraphy she did work with Ivani 
I think also in that song she do is sour she did also work with Ivani so he is a pretty good director when it's come to videos so Tanasha I may repost this article in the newspaper guys if you have read it or you know have seen it send it to my DM who call you know Nairobi Shade Room on Instagram also make sure you follow me guys it is a beautiful thing to see Tanasha that she keep winning even though she's not releasing anything like guys we all know Kua this year is definitely gonna be big for Tanasha because last year it was not a good year because Yahile contract so I feel like this year she's definitely gonna put into work so guys I also want to make this clear when I said Kua she was a little bit lazy I did not mean Kua she is lazy lazy guys she has have other business outside of the outside of music so you cannot say why she was lazy but guys when it's come to the music you can agree with me or not but I feel like she was kind lazy because you can post like covers singing covers who call instagram to not let fans get bold guys you know so when i say ra lazy it, she was not lazy obvious she was not la lazy but you know she should have been posting some covers singing who call instagram like crowe did like a lot of celebrities if they are in a bad contract they at least keep their fans you know update keep their fans watching like i met and get to me at tiktok to post some covers or instagram you know to not let fans get bored or you know start saying like you are boring you know guys that is what i mean i did not say that she is lazy lazy because she have a lot of business outside of music so she always she's definitely gonna be working every day so she's not lazy bad contract but you know doing some covers who call instagram who call wapi it is something that i don't think it can hurt the contract or anything but guys that is just my own opinion drop in the comments tell me your thoughts make sure you subscribe hit that bell notification and like the video i'm